Hello, I'm Dave Llewellyn. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. Michigan's two biggest universities are imposing COVID-19 vaccine mandates for the fall semester. The University of Michigan and Michigan State are requiring students, faculty and staff to get a shot. The presidents of both uh, institutions cited the highly contagious Delta variant in driving the, the decision. Michigan State also reinstated an indoor mask mandate on campus. Kroger is also falling in line with updated CDC guidance on masks because of the Delta variant. The grocery chain is now strongly encouraging all people to wear a mask in stores. That includes those who are vaccinated against COVID-19. Up to now, Kroger has required unvaccinated employees to wear masks and requested that unvaccinated shoppers do the same. You may run into a major detour if your weekend travels uh, take you to I-75. The northbound lanes of the freeway between I-96 and 12 Mile are shut down because of an underground sinkhole. MDOT crews knocked down part of the sound barrier wall where the ground shifted. They are working to determine what must be done to make sure the freeway is safe once again for drivers. That two-mile stretch of the freeway is expected to be closed at least through the weekend. We have a warning about scammers taking advantage of families already hurt by the flooding disaster. They're posing as disaster aid workers in Gross Point Farms. They claim they're available to help complete applications for FEMA assistance. The scams can be made on the phone by mail, email, text or in person. Remember, federal and state workers carry an ID badge and they never ask for money. You can call the FEMA disaster fraud hotline to file a complaint or your local police department. Here's meteorologist Mike Taylor now with a check of your seven first alert forecast. Hey, thanks, Dave. We'll have a nice weekend ahead, but a few chances of seeing some rain for Saturday, mainly for Saturday late night into your Sunday morning and afternoon. That's the best opportunity to see some showers and storms. 82 degrees on Saturday, but 76 for your high temp on Sunday.